Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel Master Mojo Ash. In this video I will show you Dragon Ball, the 10 most mature Saiyans, ranked. Saiyans are known for their strength and love of fighting, but some are also quite mature. One of the reasons that Akira Toriyama's Dragon Ball has become such an evergreen franchise of the anime industry is that there are so many different things to love about it. Dragon Ball fulfills shonen genre archetypes, but it presents an ever-evolving story that's satisfying in terms of characters, actions, and the changing scope of its narrative. An important component of the series is the powerful race of Saiyan warriors. Saiyans become more of a dominating presence the longer that Dragon Ball goes on, but many different versions of these elite fighters come forward. Dragon Ball is full of high-stakes danger, but some characters get a little too light-hearted for their own good. Alternatively, there are several Saiyans who are the picture-perfect vision of maturity and professionalism. Before I start the video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Number 10. Raditz. Raditz prioritizes conquest and the fundamentals during the brief time that he's around. Dragon Ball Z hits the ground running with the surprise invasion of Raditz as the first real enemy Saiyan to enter the series. It's a major shock to learn that Raditz is both Goku's brother, as well as part of an evil alien race. Raditz doesn't stick around for very long, but his significance cannot be underestimated. Raditz presents unprecedented power and tries to convince Goku to align with him and join the dark side. Raditz is all business which makes him such a terrifying presence early in the series. Number 9. Bardock. Bardock carries the weight of his people and leads a revolution. Dragon Ball takes a few opportunities to flashback to the past and highlight crucial chapters from the history of the Saiyan race. Bardock, the father of Goku provides a lengthy look into the roots of Goku's father, the destruction of planet Vegeta, and baby Goku's exodus. Bardock becomes afflicted by important visions that go on to inspire him to lead a revolution against Frieza. Bardock becomes collateral damage, but his revolt against Frieza and his army is incredibly honorable. Bardock goes out as a determined fighter, and his softer side remains hidden. Number 8. Future Gohan. Future Gohan has become hardened through a life of loss. One of the darker turns in Dragon Ball Z is the information that there's an alternate version of the future that's essentially a post-apocalyptic wasteland because no one could stop the android invasion. An extended look into future Trunks' timeline provides important context for Trunks' development as a fighter. However, it also establishes that future Trunks' mentor is future Gohan. Future Gohan is considerably different from his present timeline counterpart. He's seen all of his family and friends perish, which turns him into the no-nonsense mentor who turns future Trunks into a deadly warrior. Number 7. Cumber. Cumber is a painful experiment who only knows rage. Dragon Ball's saga continues on in Dragon Ball Super's manga, but there's also the promotional anime series, Super Dragon Ball Heroes, which presents a radically different version of the franchise as canon. Super Dragon Ball Heroes leans into the popular video game series and highlights exaggerated and alternate versions of characters. The series also introduces Cumber, a dangerously powerful Saiyan, who's brainwashed and controlled by the evil Fu. Cumber functions a lot like Brawly, but because he's rendered into a weapon with incredible power, he's one of the mature Saiyans in the series. Number 6. Fasha. Fasha represents Saiyan ideals without any compromise. There are plenty of powerful male Saiyans, but for a long time, Dragon Ball kept its female Saiyans to a minimum as a relatively benign presence. This has been rectified in several ways, but one of the original female Saiyans who gets introduced is Fasha. Fasha works alongside Bardock back during the height of the Saiyan race's success. Not much of Fasha gets shown. But what's clear is that she's dedicated to battle and the survival of her race. Fasha doesn't exhibit any lighter traits, and Bardock, the father of Goku establishes her as one of Bardock's more dependable allies. Number 5. Perugus. 
Paragus adopts a harsh and closed-off life to harden his son. Paragus and his son, Brawly, represent some of the more controversial Saiyans to come out of the Dragon Ball franchise. Brawly and Paragus get lots of play during Dragon Ball Z's movies, but the characters get a helpful and canonical revision in Dragon Ball Super, Brawly. These differences are minimal, yet crucial to their characters. Paragus basically manipulates and enslaves his son to be an unstoppable killing machine. Brawly is a victim of circumstance, but he does still show an innocent and playful side. This is absent in Paragus, who has become completely consumed by his deluded vision. Number 4. Kefla. Kefla is a fused fighter who erases her weakest traits. Dragon Ball Super brings several new Saiyans into the fray due to the introduction of Universe 6. Kaba, Gale, and Kalifla are all important characters, but they're a lot more innocent and grounded than the warrior Saiyans from Universe 7. Kale and Kalifla aren't always mature on their own, but their fused form, Kefla, is another story. Kefla eliminates the duo's weaker and less precise impulses, and it properly handles Kale's berserker state. The end result is a serious, formidable fused Saiyan fighter. Number 3. Vegeta. Vegeta is driven by Saiyan pride and an undying fighting spirit. Vegeta is one of the most popular Saiyans to come out of Dragon Ball, but he also staunchly retains the principles that defined his people back during their prime. Goku is powerful and knows when to get serious, but his goofier and naive tendencies are still present. Vegeta is a different case who is always focused on battle, his own strength, and the bigger picture. Admittedly, Vegeta's anger can sometimes overcome his level head, but he's still matured during these explosive moments. They reflect a fighter who is in control of their power and not juvenile. Number 2. King Vegeta. King Vegeta establishes the rigid ideals for the Saiyan race. King Vegeta is mostly seen through flashbacks, but his role in the series is crucial, and his rigid ideals are largely responsible for his son's determined work ethic. King Vegeta is an intelligent, passionate warrior, but he also has to worry about the safety of the entirety of the Saiyan race. King Vegeta's planetary decisions and his negotiations with Frieza and Beerus don't necessarily work out in his favor, but he's a pillar of maturity through it all. King Vegeta comes across as the proud, infallible leader of the Saiyan people. He pushes worthy ideals and isn't some antiquated ruler. Number 1. Future Trunks. Future Trunks is the ultimate victim of circumstance who grows into a legend. Since his debut, Future Trunks has been not only seriously cool but also highly powerful and practically bereft of poor qualities. Future Trunks makes an excellent first impression through his Super Saiyan transformation and enviable sword skills. Future Trunks carries the fighting principles of Vegeta, but the constant death and hardships that he's experienced in his dark timeline have turned him into a responsible fighter. Future Trunks actually struggles to unwind and act normal because conflict is such a constant part of his life. 